You listen to the third watch update for December 23rd, 2016. Probably another one of those important posts that we need to talk about. Um, if you know anything about alien abductions and some, some of which has been talked about on different um, radio and web shows, um, I, I just pulled off a few links um, and strange sp space weather events, please know there are some very important things you need to learn first. The only way, the only way you can defeat this is by the power in the name of Jesus. Um, There's just no denying. A lot of us come away with different beliefs and um, theories on this stuff, but it simply will not, and it, you cannot. Um, let me say this. Um, there are people that have had these experiences, um, and um, it feels like they're a stranglehold, and I'm just praying that you guys get this. Whoever needs to understand what's going on here. Um, I've had experiences like this for a good many years. So I'm no stranger to it. Unfortunately, uh, a girl that was sleeping in my room um, saw one in our doorway. So I can actually confirm that. Um, there's confirmations everywhere. This stuff, guys, they're not going to tell you all what's out there and what's not being revealed. But you'd have to look at these videos below to really get what's going on. It concerns me because of the rise of cannibalism. It, rise, it rises to something really, really important that you're not getting on the news. There's a lot of spin out there um, about topics that yeah, are related to cases of missing persons. But when we talk about abductions and an alien invasion, I think this is going to be that false alien invasion. Um, I, I, I think right now we're on the precipice of something very big. Um, and as described as the uh, <clears throat> the solar winds and the galactical nightmare that is about to happen, um, I believe this will be that second wave of energy. Um, and there's a lot of information and content below. I really, really caution people. If you really don't understand what's going on in the supernatural, it's time to understand it. If you don't, Please, I'm going to list some sites here below. Steve Quayle, talk about anomalies, all kinds of odd paranormal events. Ones that, while a lot of people would like to dispute, it's just something everyone's going to deal with. It's just, I can't see how it's it's going to, anybody's going to walk away. I think the, the scary part is, if you have a head knowledge, what do you do with it? And, um, Lord knows, I pray. I pray because a lot of us are in different places of what we believe and what we don't believe about Jesus. But I, I found personally that's the only way they leave. When you start screaming Jesus' name, you have to really have some vocal cords, believe me. <laughs> um, you know, in the Bible it states that for our weapons are not carnal. This isn't something you see every day, okay? You don't see it. You don't. You only know about it, and you, people have had dreams about it, experiences. But, you know, it, it falls in this line of where they say people are crazy, they are seeing things, they're hallucinating. Yet, there's all kinds of information out there about it. So do you believe the narrative that you're schizophrenic, you're crazy, you need to be mentally in institutionalized? Or do you believe hundreds of thousands of people that have experienced the same thing? So you're going to have to come up with your own realization. I just, I don't think it's going to, it's not going to be something very much hidden for very long. I, I don't know. I think everyone's going to have an encounter, or ha already has had encounters and uh, experiences like this. So I, I would hate to think that people would throw um, people on the bus, but I think it's meant to, to discredit people. We know all about it. We, we know the whole word conspiracy was meant to discredit people to begin with. Please watch these videos below. I hope it helps you. God bless and good night.